This is Franciscan Media's Saint of the Day for May 23rd. Today we celebrate Pope St. Gregory VII. Three evils plagued the Church in the 10th and early 11th centuries. First was simony, the buying and selling of sacred offices and things. Second, the unlawful marriage of the clergy. And third, so-called lay investiture, whereby kings and nobles controlled the appointment of church officials. In 1049, Pope Leo IX brought a young monk named Hildebrand to Rome to be his counselor. Hildebrand directed his reformer's attention to all the problems facing the church. Eventually, he became pope himself, taking the name Gregory VII. For twelve years, Gregory was a busy pope, fiercely resisting any attack on the liberty of the church. For this he suffered and finally died in exile in 1085. Thirty years later, the church won its struggle against lay investiture. The Gregorian reform, a milestone in the history of the church, was named after this man who tried to free the papacy and the whole church from undue control by civil rulers. Gregory reasserted the unity of the church based on Christ and expressed in the successors of St. Peter. There's more about the saints along with inspiration and Catholic resources at our website, saintoftheday.org. From Franciscan Media, this has been Saint of the Day.